New at 10 tonight, it's a horrible feeling leaving your contacts in too long. Your eyes are going to itch, of course, but even disposable lens requires some TLC. But some fear we're not paying attention to something else. And Dr. Joe now shows us why it could cause a potential eyesight problem. Clean contacts are a must, and anyone who wears them knows the drill. I empty out the old solution and put in a new solution. But in a rush to cleanse, many miss details hidden in the fine print. Did you ever read the instructions? No, probably not. I have no idea. Don't want to scare the public? So this is Dr. Shannon McQuaig is a microbiology professor. She and her class just completed a mission to uncover how clean we're keeping our contact cases and solution. I started with my fiance's contact lens case. And then asked students to volunteer theirs. I thought it would be interesting to see what it see what I'm putting in my eyeballs. The FDA recommends tossing your case every three to six months. Most students weren't aware. And I've asked them how long have you had this case? I get the look of, I have no idea. And her fiance's answer wasn't much better. I said, you know, more than three months? No, probably longer. More than six months? Probably longer. He's like, I've probably had this one for about a year. So into the test it went. And this science experiment produced some pretty interesting results. The next day I came into the lab to see what had grown and there was just bacteria completely covering the plates. Multiple cases and samples of solution tested positive for different bacteria. It was quite significant. There's tens of thousands of bacteria just in a very small volume of solution. You don't have to be a microbiologist to know not all bacteria is bad. Much of it is good. But consider this, when it comes to your contacts, location is everything. It's usually in my bathroom on the counter next to the soap dispenser. Yes, our bathrooms are dirty and multiple studies show even the most troubling germs can travel. It can become aerosolized. And what floats up in the air must come down on something else. Our hairbrush, our toothbrush, and yes, even our contact cases. All kinds of bacteria can be on the surface of that counter and a lot of people when they clean the counter, they don't think about cleaning that contact lens case as well. Does that make you want to be even more careful? Oh yeah, definitely, definitely. One thing is clear, the newer the case, the newer the solution, the fewer the bacteria. It doesn't surprise me. Dr. McQuaig says don't reuse solution and don't top it off. Let those contact lenses soak and don't wait to splurge on a new case. We would recommend changing it a little sooner, maybe every one to two months. A gift to yourself that might just offer the gift of clear sight. I'm Dr. Joe at Giovinco, Fox 13 News. And one more tip from Dr. Joe. Don't let the tip of your solution bottle actually touch your case. Turns out that's another way germs and bacteria can spread.